Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. Now, if you're getting this error message which says Face ID require stolen device protection is turned on and you can't turn this off, you're going to follow these steps to fix it. So, very first thing you're going to do is go on a browser, preferably on another device than the one that you're trying to remove it from, but you can also do it from the device. Just simply go to iCloud.com. And then you're going to sign into your iCloud account that's on that device. So enter your Apple ID and password to get in. Once you do that, you're going to go ahead and tap over here and click on Find My. Now, once you click on Find My, you're going to find the device that you want to turn that protection off. So here, for example, I find this device. And here, you're going to remove that device. So you're going to click on Remove and Remove It From It. So you're going to hit Continue. It's going to say Cannot Remove, but you're going to hit Continue to Remove It. So you'll do that first. Now, after you have done that, the next thing you're going to do is go back into your setting and then you're going to try to go into your face ID and passcode and go ahead and enter your passcode. And here you're going to go ahead and try to see if you can go ahead and turn it off. So you're going to turn this off. Now, very important thing is if you're trying to turn this off, try to be at the same location and IP like for the Wi-Fi that you originally turned this on. This way it proves that you're the original owner. So if you set it up your home, maybe at a work or somewhere else, you want to try to be at the same place. So that's kind of going to be in your known location. So you're going to go ahead and try to turn it off that way. And hopefully it works. Now, in a scenario, it doesn't work, right? Let's say you have an issue, it doesn't turn on. What you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and try to set up alternate appearance. So you're going to click on there. And from there on, when you try to do this, it's going to maybe fail and give you an issue where it says it has to wait or delay or you're going to try to add and start this delay. So you're going to start this delay and then there's going to be a timer. And during this time, you're going to try to keep the phone screen on so you don't want to go ahead and turn it off. So usually what you can do is monitor so it doesn't lock itself. So you can hit done. For example, you're going to go back to display and brightness. You can set up auto lock to never so it doesn't lock your phone and just keep it connected to a, a charger possibly so that it doesn't die during the process. With this not locking and you waiting one hour and then you can come back into your face ID and passcode again and then go ahead into your device and then here it should finally let you go ahead and turn that off. So that's going to be the fix for this. And I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.